Okay, we are going to be assembling this and then disassembling this. What we have is a platform uh, manufactured out of steel here, composite material, a lot of anti slip uh, features built into it there. Uh, then we've got two six foot ladders. These two six foot ladders can be snapped together. Uh, each of these have one foot distance between the rungs, which means that the platform can go up by one foot in each side. And they don't need to be identical. You could set one at the two foot and the other one here at the six foot. And you'd be uh, able then to, to use that in, for example, in a, in a certain type of stairwell. Uh, so, just a little bit more detail. You can see in the side, there's some holes here for each of these. And that's where the side bracing goes. So each of these side rails of the, of the uh, ladder component is gonna help us assemble the platform. There's also these hooks here that do connect the two pieces together. And I like to keep them to the outside so that when I'm working on the platform, I'm not catching my uh, shirt or sweater or, or work work on that. So you wanna protect your floor. This thing will damage every floor you have except for maybe some concrete. If you're careful, it won't damage the concrete. I'm gonna lift it. I'm gonna slip this in. I'm gonna put this at the third rung. So I hook it on and then I make it perpendicular to the platform. So now that we're perpendicular, the platform and the ladder component are perpendicular to each other, nice and snug. I'm gonna take one of these braces. Now on the side, there's two holes here, two holes here, two holes here, two holes here. Two holes here. It depends on whether you're going down or up as to which hole uh, this needs to go in. If you end up not being able to put these uh, nubs inside the hole because it just doesn't fit, it means that you're in the wrong hole down here. They will fit. So in this circumstance, I'm gonna use the first, the most outside hole, slip it in there, and then drop over the latch. So this latch here that's swinging drops down onto the rail of the ladder and it adds security so that it, this, this can't pop out of the, uh, of the rail. Side rail. Okay, so again, first hole, slip it in, dropped it. So now this side is secure and I can actually lift it up. Okay, it's nice and secure. And because of that, I'm going to then move on to the second rail. Here we go. Third. Okay, so then I can do exactly the same thing, add these two braces in here, but as I mentioned, you could put it into a different position. So I'm going to put it in an offset position where this is actually going to be too higher. Okay, so now again, this would be useful when you're on a staircase. So, perpendicular again, and in this circumstance, say I put it in the, in, I'll do this correctly and I'll do the other one on your side, incorrectly. Again, we have the two holes over here, I'm going to put it in the wrong hole as a demonstration. It just won't hit this hole here, so obviously I need to use the correct hole here, slips in, there. Now. When I'm moving this around, these guys can just pop off like that, just from the jiggling. And you don't want that because then this could pop out, uh, pop out and the whole thing could collapse on you. So what I do is, and you see I have a residue of uh, masking tape, I just take the masking tape and tape it down. I'm gonna be using it for five hours like this, or one hour like that, or 10 minutes like that. I wanna tape it down, just so it doesn't pop up and pop off. because. That is a very unsecure platform. So these are actually the key, key to your safety are these braces. So it keeps everything stable so that you don't have any direction this way, rocking. And of course, that's how all the components uh, come together. So now disassembly, very similar. It's this in reverse, but you just have to be a little bit more careful because it wants to come apart. So again, first one, I set it down over the second one. And now you have to be ready for it. I'm gonna put my hand in here, take that apart. Set it down. Set this back.
back on the floor. And because that end is still braced, it's very secure. Okay, and then it's take all, uh, take apart the last uh, braces off the side. Again, there, dropping it off. Here, some rubber feet on the on the uh, base, and you can see now that's 30 inches wide there at the base. So you end up with some stability. It won't want to fall over in that direction for you. You definitely want to keep all your weight inside on the platform. You have 17 inches to work, so there's no reason to uh, to be reaching out too far. Anyways, that's the assembly and disassembly.